So where are you from? Missouri. And you've been a patient of mine for years. Yes. I sent you off for braces. Yes. Your braces came off last week. Yes, they did. What happened? Well, just before they came off, they started hurting really bad. And, and I thought, well, it was because they were screaming at me, take me off. <laughs> yeah. And so after they came off, I had excruciating pain. And I was just um, taking some medication to try to help it. And, and even before I could take more, it just hurt so bad I couldn't eat on it. Cold just sent me through the roof. And uh, even hot things weren't comfortable. Right. And uh, so then I came to see you, and you adjusted the bite a little bit, and uh, within about, well, the next day I noticed a difference. Yeah. And each day got a little better until finally I can put ice on it and it doesn't hurt. Cleaning my teeth, bleaching my teeth, I have no sensitivity. Yeah. And I have been eating on this side for about the last uh, three or four days. Right, so it's only yeah. been about five and a half days or so, yeah. five days. I took my last pain medication Thursday night about 10 o'clock. A day later? Mm -hmm. And you haven't had anything since? No. So it's gone from something big to, so, yes. to almost nothing? Or yeah. Now it's gone, right? I would have rated it on a pain scale of about eight or nine. I mean, it was very severe, yes. I was, was just like this. Was it waking you up at night? <clears throat> uh, yes, uh, it would wake me up. Mm -hmm. And it was hard to um, drink because it just hurt so bad. Yeah, and that, that started happening like a week or two before you took the braces uh, off, right? Almost a week. A week. And it started with just the bottom jaw, but about two days later it was also involving the top jaw, which seemed strange On to me. On the left me. side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. So you had no problems with that before? No. And we don't have any significant, there's no new dental work. I mean, there's a couple of little crowns in the mm -hmm. area, but they're, we looked at those last time. Right and you were in great shape. And when we were looking at you for potential root canal mm -hmm. problems, you know, two of your teeth were sore to percussion where we right. tap on it, remember right. that? And it doesn't make sense because there's nothing organically wrong with that. Right. So do you understand what we did that day? I mean, does it make mm -hmm. sense? You were trying to, from what I understand, level out my bite so that when I bit down, it was more uniform bite throughout my whole mouth and not just putting all the pressure and the bite on a couple of teeth on this side. Well, that's <laughs> partially true. It's not just the bite down, it's the sideways movements, mm -hmm. what they call the excursions. In other words, when you're chewing left and right, you know, mm -hmm. it's all that. Th that stuff, basically, if things don't fit quite right, if they're not perfectly aligned, and you can't do that without looking with computer technology, mm -hmm. unfortunately. Um, you know, a lot of people will move the teeth on their own. Uh -huh. Like there's millions of people a year that get their braces off and they're really cold sensitive. Most of them get by with it. Why? Because brain pushes muscle to move things enough mm -hmm. uh, to kind of correct it. So all of a sudden it gets better and better. Some of them, it's a chronic problem they deal with all the time. And they start walking in saying, I've got sensitive teeth for the rest of their life. Mm. But they're not ramping up as high as you were. Oh, yeah. So, you know, and then eventually a lot of these people can have what are called TMD problems, like a TMJ problem. Mm -hmm. And they've got chronic headaches and all this. Why? Because the teeth don't quite fit right. They may look beautiful. They may be lined up just the way the orthodontist was taught to do it in yeah. school and the way they believe is right. But it's kind of like slapping tires on a vehicle without aligning it. Well, besides looking good, they have to be functional. And I felt yeah. like mine looked great after they what awesome. they've been. Yeah. But it was like, oh, I can't eat. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's a problem, <laughs> <laughs> basically. Anyhow, so yeah, so basically what we did for you was we, we had you moving sideways. Mm -hmm. We did very, very little. There was a couple of things on your back, on your back teeth that were a little off. Mm -hmm. they, were hitting, they, they weren't hitting when you bite flat down as much as it was sideways. Mm. Okay. That's what made the difference. And, and, it, and that day, we hit you with an ice water swish. Yes, several before, of them. <laughs> yeah, before we did it, it was, it was excruciating, was it not? Right. And then at the end of that appointment, about 10 minutes later, we swished again. What was that like? It was much less painful. And much then it got less. progressively better over the last few days. So and now each 24 hours was a big difference. Yeah, because you're moving it the rest of the way, mm -hmm. the last of it. That's what's going on. So ice water. So, so last time when I had you swish, zero to mm -hmm. ten, what, what did you think it was? It was about nine ten. Okay, try it now. This is five days later. What do you got? Maybe a two. So what do you think of that? 
Yeah, I don't need any pills or anything. That's and it's thing. gone now. It's already gone. So you glad you had it done? Yes. All right. Thank yes. you very much. Mm -hmm.